However, one many people immediately think of action movies and fighting anytime martial arts is brought up. A competition though in Houghton yesterday set out to dispel some of those myths. A group of martial artists went through several rounds of skills competition in hopes of making it to the U.S. National Tournament to be held in Dearborn later this year. Kids from the Upper Peninsula, Minnesota, and Wisconsin made the trip to Houghton Elementary School to show off everything they've learned so far. Organizers at the event say that karate is far more of a mental sport than what is portrayed in Hollywood. Martial arts is really significant in people's lives because it changes people's lives in the way they think about stuff. It takes away from the small-mindedness and opens up people to different opportunities as well. It makes them more outgoing and adds confidence to their own personal character as well. But competition allows for a lot of confidence building. Especially for a small tournament like this, there's a lot of first-time competitors here. It's building confidence and also perseverance. It's telling kids that, you know, even if you don't make it, there's always next year to keep trying. All but four of the competitors earn the right to go to the national tournament in Dearborn in early June where they have a chance to advance to the international event in Montreal, Canada later this year. Well, believe it or not, we got a baseball game in today in the Upper Peninsula despite all the rain. Gladstone must have started early, knocked off Channing 10-0 in game one and of course washed out in game number two for obvious reasons if you looked outside your window today. And of course for those scores and much, much more, you can head to our website upmissionsource.com in the sports section for all sorts of Good stuff. And top five results. Kozlowski gets the win. Kyle Busch gets second place for his efforts there. Matt Kenseth third. Casey Kane fourth. Greg Biffle fifth. The updated Sprint Cup standings. Greg Biffle still on top. Matt Kenseth moves up two spots. Dale Earnhardt Jr. falls from second to third, followed by Denny Hamlin and Kevin Harwood. Just some good old-fashioned teamwork there on the backstretch at NASCAR. Teamwork, and it always seems like they're scheming who's going to crash that week. Scheming you know, the there's game. always that more energy. the name of the game. It is a chess match on the racetrack. I go first, then you go next week, and Absolutely. so forth. Absolutely. It's a great sport if you get into it. I, get, I am into it. Oh, I'm yes. talking to some folks at home who think it's just turning left. No. Which there's, it is. There's a lot more to that. There's more to it. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Mike.